Periscopers. Welcome to my home. Today is Anderson's birthday party, so as you can see, the table's all set and we're getting ready. So thank y'all for joining. Hi, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome to my house. Hope everybody's having a great day today. Hi, Kim. Hey, y'all. Welcome to my house. Yes, this is Anderson's birthday today, so I'm getting ready for his birthday party. What are y'all doing today? <laughs> oh, it's Anderson's birthday, so it is a busy, busy, busy day, but it's a lot of fun. I will turn the camera and show you guys a little bit of what I'm doing today. Oh, Renee, you're working? Good. Me too. Me too. Working hard, Sade. I know you are. Um, so, Anderson is turning four today. He is my grandson. Uh, thanks, Mom. I thought you might like this top. <laughs> That's hers. <laughs> uh, but anyway, so I'm busy getting ready. So, we have been talking about the home and the importance of making your home a place of love and peace. The importance of hospitality. Your purge while the boys are hanging out with Dad planning. Oh, nice. Good. <laughs> Hey Megan, thanks for telling Anderson happy birthday. So it's going to be a fun night with family and friends. We've been talking about the home experience and the home experience book. Uh, that's my mom's book. So I hope that you guys can catch the replay from last night and also go on my website if you'd like to see more. And um, this is the use what you have principle. Y'all, whenever you use what you have, there's two ways you can think of this use what you have. In other words, if you have it, use it. Oh, hi, Claire. We miss you. If you have it, use it. So if you have a home, use it. You can have birthday parties at your house. You can have family dinners at your house. You can have guests over to your home. If you have a home, use it. <laughs> use it. It's not just to sleep. It's there to, to hang out and to have a good time. Um, okay. And also, use what you have. So Brittany just decided that we would throw this party last minute together. So if you saw my Periscope Tuesday night, she's like, let's just have the party at your house. So she came over and what I did Tuesday is I went ahead and I got, um, I got the balloons ahead of time because she wanted to decorate on Tuesday night. That's what worked best within her schedule so that Andy could be home with the boys. So y'all, pr preparation, planning in advance is really is what's going to keep the peace during the process. Make sure that your party is manageable. So it doesn't have to be too big for little kids. It doesn't have to have too many people invited, um, but just a few friends and family, and it can be a really fun party. It doesn't have have to be expensive. It doesn't have to be all Pinterest perfect, although it can be at times, and we have those kind of parties too. This one is just thrown together. It's really simple, but I will show y'all what we did and what I did. It's There's really nothing fancy or special about it, but it's going to seem special to him, and it's just special because I prepared for it, and it's special because he loves coming to Nina and Pa's house. That's right. This is not expensive at all. I just We just used what we had, and we just made it really super easy. Um, but anyway, it does have a a little bit of a theme so that's always important when you're party planning make sure you have a theme I like to do a color scheme um, based on whatever the theme is and just use what you have so what we did today I'll turn the camera around um, that's right everything is special whenever you do it hi Darius oh I'm so glad that you're that you're on Periscope you've got to learn about Periscope and start doing this and catch the replay there where it says recent so you can watch my mom and I last night in her home so um, this is a great, great way to just connect with people all over the world. So welcome to everybody who is periscoping all over the world. I should introduce myself for those of you who don't know me. I'm Trina Titus Lozano, and I'm a counselor, and I'm an ordained Christian minister, and I'm a mom, and I have... Um, Excuse me, gotta block the trolls. I'm a mom, I've got four kids, but three are married, so that's seven kids, and I have nine grandkids, and we just like to have lots of um, family fun, and everything that I do is based out of the home. So all of ministry, all of all of my counseling, everything, I, I make sure that I do what I tell other people to do at home first. So I just figured that I would just tell y'all uh, what it was like at going on at my house today. So it's a busy day, but here's what's going on at my house today, and I'll just go ahead and um, um, well, I'll just turn the camera this way, maybe. There we go. Okay, so yeah, I have um, a table that I set for 18. This is my dining room table. I actually put four tables together to achieve this effect. And um, 
To decorate for this party, we just used the toys that he already had. They were his favorite toys. Anderson loves rescue bots. So you can see the rescue bots sitting on the table. So we just used toys that he had. They're his favorite toys and that became the decorations. Um, the table runner is wrapping paper. So I just unrolled a roll of wrapping paper to use as the table runner. It is colorful, you know, the toys are colorful. Um, and so we just really matched the toys. But this is the way the table looked. And instead of decorating the whole house, like sometimes we do for some parties, today, just to make it simple, I just decided to just decorate this one area. So just the dining room is really decorated. Um, balloons are a great way to decorate. They're festive, they're fun, they're colorful, they're inexpensive. But if you're gonna do something in advance, just have them put the extra helium in them so that they will last, you know, a few days. Um, yeah, and so the wrapping paper acts as the table runner, and then we just layered two wrapping papers there. Um, he is only four. Yeah, he's only four years old, so he will appreciate this. But just set the table with paper plates and paper napkins, colorful napkins. Um, but I like to preset everything. The What I did with the juice and for the drinks, I was trying to think about who is coming. So with the kids coming, I got these little barrel drinks that I can just poke the straw in and they already match everything. So I like to preset the drinks, think in advance what everybody's going to need. It's a pizza party tonight, so we're just having pizza. And Brittany baked the cupcakes, so it's pizza and homemade cupcakes. And uh, these little barrel drinks are cute because they're juice and they're 100% natural and they um, have the little straws, so you just, you know, they, and they match the table. So that way it'll be really easy. For the centerpieces, I just put um, fruit snacks and of course a little bit of candy in the buckets, which is holding the balloons. Um, you know, these are available at the dollar store. It's not expensive at all. And then you can use them after for organizing and, and things. Um, for the napkins, what I did is I, I used these little bracelets as the favor and then also doubling as a napkin ring here and I put the spoon in because they'll use the individual cup ice creams you know same you can see here the the bracelet so and then the spoon's already set in the napkin and then a drink will just poke the straw on the top of it and all the little kids will be ready to go so it's really simple it's really basic Nothing here is expensive. The banner that you see there, we use over and over and over again for everybody's birthday. <laughs> so anyway, that's the party tonight. I hope y'all are inspired because really, it's nothing more than setting the table. But but Anderson's going to feel special. So I know that he'll feel special because the table is set for him when he comes in. And uh, I FaceTimed with him earlier this morning and got and he got to see the way that the table set. So he's going to look forward to that. Um, oh, the bracelets say different things about rescue bots and transformers. That's the, it's the theme of what his toys are, mom. So, um, so I just use those. So they'll be the favors and the napkin rings. <laughs> so anyway, I hope y'all are inspired. Keep it simple. Make it cheery. Make it fun. Plan. Prepare. Use what you have. Use, um, in this case, the, the creative ideas the wrapping paper for a table runner, especially for a table as big as mine. It works really well. So I hope y'all are inspired to just use things differently, be creative, keep it simple, but especially always celebrate birthdays. And most of all, invite people to your home. And so I hope you guys are inspired to do that today. I've got a lot to do. So this is a short Periscope day, but I will be back at nine and I'll let you know how it all went. Okay. Bye y'all. Have a great day. Thanks for joining me.